Man, I can't believe we're actually gonna become hell divers. Sorry, did you say hell divers? Hell diver training is the toughest test in the galaxy. But I can tell that doesn't scare you. In all my years, huh? I've never witnessed such oh. acrobatic perfection. Oops. Ah. Impeccable. Use a grenade to close up that bug hole. Oh. No, no. Okay, bye guys. Bye guys. What a catapult of an arm. This should be easy. I've never seen such flawless terminal activation. You've advanced the cause of democracy further than any soldier I've ever seen. Just put a dime here. Now there's a hell diver. I'll step back and move. I really did not think I would be as into this game as I am right now. I actually dreamt about being in a hell pod last night, hearing the Helldivers 2 theme tune over the intercom to psych me up before I was landing on a planet to keep some peace and spread that democracy. So yeah, I'm mentally and emotionally invested, it would seem. To say the least, Helldivers 2 is a game that is blowing up over the past week, but if you don't know what it's about, Quite simply, you play a soldier better known as a Helldiver who is trying to spread democracy across the galaxy during an intergalactic war with Terminids and Automatons. And those are the two initial factions in Helldivers 2 that are sweeping through the planets in the galaxy. The game server cap keeps getting met and they keep having to increase it because the demand for the game is so much more than what the developers expected. And it's understandable because the all-time peak of concurrent players in Helldivers 1 was 7,000 and that's over a period of nine years. And in just a week, Helldivers 2 has already surpassed half a million concurrent players. Now, whether that's from Steam alone or it's cross-platform, because of course it's on PC and PlayStation, I'm not totally sure. But I do know that Sony just announced you do not need PS Plus in order to play this online. I'm having a great time, but like many others, I've been playing it alone. Not solo, but simply queuing with any Helldiver who would have me. And if I'm being honest, I expected queuing with strangers to be, no, please, please, a rather challenging experience. But when I finally got to play with others, I realized how wrong I was and that all the great moments and memories I had when I was growing up playing games on my Xbox, just teaming up with randoms and making it work, they all flooded back. And this game, in my opinion, has made time travel possible. Having now played with Helldivers from all around the globe, I can easily say that not only was it worth it, but I wanted to do it more and more and more. So we're looking for SOS Beacons here, which is a player in need of help. And I love this system because if you're alone on a planet and you need help, you can throw down one of these SOS stratagems, which is like a little ball that shoots a beacon of light up into the atmosphere. It'll make you available for matchmaking with people who are looking to help pour out a cup of that liberty. Stratagems are used for all types of functions, including weapons, air support, and more, but you'll see how they work as we get into it. But before we do that, you might be wondering, well, Dave, why can't I just play completely by myself? Well, I have, and from experience... Oh my... Why am I here? Am I... Oh! oh. <laughs> am I out of ammo? I'm out of ammo. Yeah, let's just stop here and reload. That's great. It's not worth the heartache. Buddy up with strangers, and trust me, you're going to have an experience that you will love. Like for Liberty, subscribe for Super Earth, but enough chat, let's go help some hell divers. What a sequence. This gives me hell jumper vibes, I'm not gonna lie. Which is not a bad thing. More of that. Alright. Look at that green moon. Okay, seems pretty pretty quiet over here. Looks like we found a satellite of some sort. Okay, so the little combo on the left there, upload data. You just hold control on PC. I think it's different on um, PlayStation. You can use the stratagem combo to upload the data from these back to the ship. Look at that, dude. Just look at that. 
That is gorgeous. Loving that. <laughs> this is kind of going to salute. That's pretty good. I dig it. Back, 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 back. It's not that big. Back. That's fine. <laughs> it was that big. And it wasn't fine. Right? Oh, we got big boys. Coming in. Big bugs coming in hot. I think the ones I hate the most so far are the ones that, like, they flank you. The flankers, definitely. Not a fan of the flankers. Those guys there. No, 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 no. Oh, we got guys up here. Oh, okay. In the jungle, actually, this is kind of scary looking. Just because they kind of come out of just the foliage. And they're right in front of you all of a sudden. Ooh. Must be this guy. Let me grab these launch codes. Nice. Okay. So what I'm realizing is I think you just need a bit of a, you know, team that's going to stick together. You don't necessarily need to be communicating with each other all that much, I don't think. I think that will be the case, though. I think you will need to communicate more as time goes on. And that'll be like the make or break between what teams survive and what ones don't like in most games really but it is pretty easy to communicate with each other see where you are see where people are going and they've done that really well without having to use a microphone but on the flip side i like to speak to people so i'm hoping somebody's going to respond to me at some point so if you want to check your ammo just hold r or whatever the reload button is and it's going to show that little pop-up that you saw there i had one bullet so i was able to tell that if i took a next shot i'd be screwed you can have that all on screen if you want as well but i kind of like talking Woo! yeah i like talking the hud elements away where i can is that ammo did i burn myself i do it for democracy it's okay Fine, scream it out. Scream it out. That's what I do. Going for it. Oh, God. Move out of the way. Point me to, oh my God. Could that be closer? <laughs> Whoa. Okay, all right. I think I lost my machine gun. It is what it is. Oh! Oh god! Oh. <laughs> that laugh says everything I need to know. Alright, so we have the launch codes and our buddy here is going to enter them. Flawless? First time? Oh, so this is the launch code. We gotta lift these. Unlock the hatch. So our nuke can get up. <laughs> I think it's dead. Oh, okay. I have a lot to learn. Off it goes. Boom. Oh my god. Oh. 
Oh, that's awesome. I was kind of expecting to be completely knocked back like this. <laughs> Calling in an it's merely a neck. Drop me another. Okay, it's time to get out of here. Call the evac. Get back, demon! Oh no! <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell was that? Oh my god. <laughs> and then we got a uh, safe artillery. That'll do nicely there. Oh, wait. Artillery? <laughs> okay. Artillery is not what I thought it was. I thought it was a, uh, like a gun, like an artillery gun. No. No, that would that would be that would be an artillery gun. Just in case, you know, just just spread the love a bit. Don't get squashed. Oh my god. It was never in doubt. So I've upped the ante and we're going for challenging difficulty now. We've managed to get another group who had an SOS beacon and... Oh wow. I think I need to upgrade the budget for the pods on my ship because... 2D a pod's just not sustainable. Thank you very much. Is there a hero behind me? This guy's ready to go. Okay. Didn't even get a salute. We have no time. I respect it. All right. Let's do this. So as far as I know, we're heading to this planet Meridia to clear out all of the alien nests that are full of eggs. Standard procedure, right? Hell divers do this every day. Big old bug nests. And uh, I'm hoping challenging is going to be a step above. Maybe a bit more intense, a bit faster. But we'll see. See how quickly it ramps up. Okay, it's ramped up. Let's go. <laughs> the only good bug is a death. Hey! Don't you hit me. And I'm dead. So if you see in the top left hand corner, it says 19. That's how many reinforcements you can call in immediately. After you run out of those, you start to see a timer of about 90 seconds, I think, or maybe two minutes. Oh my God, please. Oh yeah, I forgot the terminids hate whenever you give useful tips. So much so, they will murder you. Oh, someone else has died as well. Okay, this is just absolute insanity. Can I squash one of these bugs? I think I squashed a bug. Democracy has landed. It's landed, baby. So I've got like a auto shotgun. And I'm regretting my decision. Actually, the auto shotgun might be the thing for this. I'm not sure. These things follow you so quickly, the hunters. Gotta watch your back. Running out of ammo. Dead killed by my teammate. Yeah, so challenging immediately is far more fun, but also I'm awful at it. All right, let's spread some democracy. Are you serious? Just to put in perspective how it's going. <laughs> Three hell divers. Three hell pods landing at once. Yeah. Yeah, I'm staying up here. I'm calling in. Whoever's immediately died as well. So we've went from 20 reinforcements down to 10. Let me get a machine gun. I think this is the longest that more than one of us has been alive. Give me that. Yeah, okay. It's party time. I can't even see what's happening right now. Let's get these gone. What friggin' time? God, don't do that. I can hear 
the chaos, but I can't see them. Okay, that's gone. Oh no. Orbital strike. Run, 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 run. No, 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 no. Can't shoot him in the face. The charger is just pure armor. He's got a soft back. That's about it. I don't know enough about him yet. No! no! Oh, I'm okay. Just fell into a giant shrimp. A langoustine. Mm. Now I want seafood. Whatever's causing these spores, we need to get rid of it. It cannot be like this. It's so, it's so dense. Ah. Oh, I'm out of stems. And they're coming. And the teammate died. Just spray and pray. How many bolts I have left? No time to check. Let's get him back in. Just hope that the charger doesn't see me. That has no bullets in it. Absolutely not. Not today, pal. You know, I'm warming to the shotgun a wee bit. Oh! No, please. No, no, no. Don't, don't rotate. Don't charge. Oh. Coming in hot. Oh. Please tell him I didn't just kill him. My own teammate. Well, you know. That's not good. Let's, let's bring in another one. No, please. Two chargers. Oh, sweet. Yes, run. Yes, run. Run, run, run. Run cubed. Run three. Oh. Why are we here? I just wanted to be... Don't dive on the map! Yeah. Exactly. I'm just playing the game with this guy. You're not gonna get me. Oh god. They might though. Oh my god, don't run through the beam. Oh. <laughs> that was a near miss. Oh, not the hunters. Enough. Your tendrils. Get back. Enough of your tomfoolery. One other thing to note is that usually if you reload a mag and there's still bullets in it, you lose the whole mag. Whereas with like the shotgun, you're loading it shell by shell. So if you're instinctively a reloader, shotgun's gonna be fine. But otherwise, you're probably gonna want to start having some reload discipline. Something I definitely don't have, but I'm, I'm working on it. At this point, we decided we were gonna make a push for the main objective. And we had a guy already there that we were trying to get the hold back until we were there and can make an orbital strike. Guys, get out of there. Orbital strike coming in. You're gonna die. You're good. There we go. Right, get ready to run. Get ready to run. All right, running, running. Where did he put it? It's behind us. Run, 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 run. Okay, running, running. I'm not making the same mistake I made earlier. Should I keep running? Oh. <laughs> That's good. The radius on that thing is insane. That is mad. All right, let's clear out some of these eggs. Eggs and bugs. Get some. Nice. Oh, I actually love the aim down sight. Like the detail on the guns is great. Don't worry, I'm not advocating for a first-person only version of Helldivers. Not every game I play needs to become a first-person game. 
They've done a lot of work on it, though. It does look good. Ooh, give me these. Stems? Yes, please. I'll take one. Oh, here we go. Oh. That grenade launcher? What a beast. What an absolute monster of a gun. Yeah. I'll help him out. He's probably going to do the main work here, like, but... Oh my goodness, so good. And then my pathetic one. Yeah! Hey, listen! My final hit, that's what made it happen. He gets it. Oh, it's party time. Let's call in some mines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell is that? What? I'm not walking in front of that. That thing's insane. I want that. Oh, singed myself. It's fine. Oh, here we got more. Just when they emerge out of the smoke and you think you're done and then a full new wave of them comes in. The range in the shotgun's pretty good. Let's get a wee, get a wee ammo dump down. Oh my god, more. I hate these hunters. See when these guys are chasing you? Look at this guy, he's like side strafing. He's such a creep. Get out of here. Oh! Sweet liberty! My life! G-Man just took my samples. He just ran over to my body, took my samples, and he said, My bad. G-Man needs to watch his back. Because Liberty... It comes from all angles, especially from behind. <laughs> I signed evil. I'm not going to kill G-Man. But if he dies, he dies. If he dies, he dies. Not by my hand, obviously. I would never pull the grudge. I wonder which one he is. Okay, he's D1. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> He took my sample. I won't forget it. Oh yeah, classic G-Man acquiring samples. Typical G-Man. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm over it. I'm not over it. Oh, this looks like a big nest. Nice. He was away. Let's get some orbital. Oh, one, two, three. And... The charger's gone all the way through it and straight up to me. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do that. Don't do that. Me. Oh, Goose Guy, don't die, please. Is this the end? Where's my camera gone? Oh, yeah, let's look at my corpse. Let's remember what I did. Nothing. Let's check the limbs. Left arm gone, right leg gone, body gone, right arm gone, right leg gone. Okay. Still got my head, though. Hell dive it in. Right into the center of everything. Oh my lord. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I could have went a bit further away, but where's the fun in that? These guys are just going down, I think. Don't stab on those. God, we can't call anybody in. Oh god, chargers. Oh no. We can't call, I can't call anyone in. The cooldown's still on a minute. I've got to survive for a minute. Well, we're off for a run, I guess. We're running. I don't think we're doing the objective for the next 60 seconds. Let's call in a machine gun. Ah! Don't think so. Get back. Ah! Receive the message. Oh my lord. Action dive! Oh! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, we didn't hit the mine this time. I have an affinity for dive it on the incendiary mines. Let's throw him over there. Get him in, but keep him out of danger. It's the best we can hope for. Okay, G-Man, let's get out of here. Just fall by. Yeah. Calling down 
Come on, let's go. Back up, back up. No! Watch those, watch those. <laughs> That's fine, it's a charger, it's a charger, it's totally fine. Just dance around it, dance around it. Grenade in here. Let's get these nests going. Oh! Yep. Don't throw a grenade and then run in the direction of your own grenade. That's a wee super earth tip from the top. Don't die. G-Man, please. His trigger discipline's good. You can't, I can't knock it. I'm out of everything. G-Man, we gotta go. He's holding them off for me. I was wrong about you, G-Man. You're the real deal. G-Man's coming. Oh, <laughs> he's brought a surprise. Oh, great. Oh, wow. So many hunters. We're getting one more in. That's us up to three. Looking good. And G-Man's dead. We're back to two. Okay. I got Fanny Dantum. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Just keep running away. He's gone. He doesn't need my instructions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Precision strike. Run, run, run. I'm running. <laughs> you don't need to tell me. I've been running for three minutes straight. That is so close. This isn't even the same guy from earlier who told me the back up. I'm still forgetting how big those orbital strikes are. Hey! No jumping. And amount of ammo. But that doesn't matter. Get rinsed. Come over here, over here. Come with me, come with me. Yeah, yeah, coming now. An eagle? Oh. The bird that goes brrr. I genuinely cannot imagine what this is like on higher difficulties. I re <laughs> I'm just not good at it yet. Really not. But I love this chaos. Ah! Please, hunter! It's just insane. Need to figure out the mechanics of these chargers, though. Yes. Happily, if I can just survive. High am I alive right now? Shove it in your neck. Okay. Keep going, keep going. The rain and everything. Oh, he's chasing me. Why is he so good at the pivot? Don't you do it! Oh, his mouth. Oh, cripes. Well... I don't think I've ever said cripes, so I don't know why I said that. This game's turning on my brain the soup. So, everyone's dead. <laughs> and it's just dropped me back in on my own. With two minutes before I can reinforce. What can go wrong? After managing to survive for another two minutes, I called in reinforcements from Fanny Dantum, and we made plans to head straight towards the main objective, which was destroy all of the eggs in the bug hive. And much to my surprise, I got to play with a new weapon. Let's give us a go. Oh, the sound of it! Oh, it's melting them! I love this so much. It makes me think of the Laz Cannon from 40k. Apparently, on colder planets as well, it takes longer for this to overheat. I'm not down today. That's right! They definitely die, by the way. They die a lot. Oh my goodness. I think we're about to see an example of them dying a lot. My leg's wrecked. I've got so many hunters on me. Fanny, help me! He's probably got his own thing going on. Not today! Oh, I guess yesterday. Oh, my common sample, no! Oh, mission accomplished, though. He just has to get out now. So, skipping ahead, effectively what happened was everyone died again. Everyone died, I just watched them all die, couldn't do a thing about it. And now the destroyer has left orbit, so we can't even bring the back in. There's no way to reinforce now. We've over- <laughs> We've used every available reinforcement stratagem, and every cooldown as well. And the timer's run out, so we've got nothing. We can't call in orbital strikes. We literally have to survive until the extraction ship gets here. So I just gotta 
Oh my lord, no, don't you dare. Dive, dive and stim, dive and stim. Enough! Take some democracy! Oh, I got the charger as well. I got the hunters, I got the chargers. Oh, uh, I don't know where to go. I don't know where Sif. I need to be on site for the, the extraction. There's so many hunters. I just gotta clear them. I have nothing else to clear them except this gun. No, please! Don't you do it! There's the extraction! Oh my... Oh my... No! You know, something we actually did all right there because we completed the mission. We all died, but that's the Helldiver way. We gave our lives for the cause, for Super Earth, for duty, for liberty, for democracy. If you guys enjoyed this, let me know. And if you watched this far, you're the real deal. Okay? See you later. Bye.